welcome here the question says write in exponential notation and they have given us two numbers the first number is 32 and the second number is 675 so we have to write these two numbers in exponential notation so first i will write 32 in its exponential form so in order to write 32 in its exponential form I have to do the prime factorization of 32. So we have to do the prime factorization of 32. Now in prime factorization we keep on dividing this number till it becomes 1 and we have to divide this number by the prime numbers. Now 2 is the smallest prime number and 32 is divisible by 2 so I will divide 32 by 2 so 32 divided by 2 is what it is 16 now 16 is again divisible by 2 so I will divide 16 by 2 so 16 divided by 2 is 8 now 8 is again divisible by 2 so I will divide 8 by 2 so 8 divided by 2 is 4 now 4 4 is again divisible by 2 so I will divide 4 by 2 so 4 divided by 2 is 2 now 2 2 is again divisible by 2 so I will divide 2 by 2 2 divided by 2 is 1 and now it has become 1 so we have to stop the process over here so 32 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. So 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. And what is this? 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. 2 multiplied to itself 5 times. And that I can write it as 2 raised to the power of 5. 2 multiplied to itself 5 times can be written as 2 raised to the power of 5. So 32 when it is written in its exponential form it is 2 raised to the power of 5. So the answer is 2 raised to the power of 5. 32 in its exponential form is 2 raised to the power of 5. Now let us do the second question. We have to write 675 in its exponential form so in order to write 675 in its exponential form we have to do the prime factorization of 675 now in prime factorization we keep on dividing this number till it becomes 1 and we have to divide this number by the prime numbers so the smallest prime number is 2 but 675 is not divisible by 2. The next prime number after 2 is 3. Let us check whether 6, 675 is divisible by 3 or not. So in order to check whether 675 is divisible by 3 or not, we have to do the divisibility test of 3 for 675. The divisibility test of 3 is you just add all the digits of this number and see whether the sum is divisible by 3 or not. So 675. So add the digits. So 6 plus 7 is 13. 13 plus 5 is 18. And 18 is divisible by 3. So 675 is also divisible by 3. So I will divide 675 by 3. So 675 divided by 3. So what is that? So 3 2 is a 6. 3 2 is a 6. Remainder 1. Bring this 5 down. So 15. 3 5 is a 15. So 675 divided by 3 is 225. Now 225. Let us check whether it is again divisible by 3 or not. So 2 plus 2 is 4. 4 plus 5 is 9. And 9 is divisible by 3. 
so 225 is also divisible by 3 so I will divide 225 by 3 so what is that so 3 7 are 21 remainder 1 bring this 5 down so 15 3 5 are 15 so 225 divided by 3 is 75 now 75 is it divisible by 3 let us check it so 7 plus 5 is 12 and 12 is divisible by 3 so 75 is also divisible by 3 so I will divide 75 by 3 so what is 75 divided by 3 3 2s are 6 remainder 1 bring this 5 down 15 3 5s are 15 so 75 divided by 3 is 25 now is 25 divisible by 3 2 plus 5 is 7 and 7 is not divisible by 3 so 25 is not divisible by 3 so the next prime number after 3 is 5 and 25 is divisible by 5 so I will divide 25 by 5 so what is 25 divided by 5 it is 5 25 divided by 5 is 5 and 5 is again divisible by 5 so I will divide 5 by 5 what is 5 divided by 5 it is 1 so it has become 1 so stop the process over here so 675 is 3 into 3 into 3 into 5 into 5 so 675 is equal to 3 into 3 into 3 into 5 into 5 and this I can write it as 3 into 3 into 3 it is 3 raised to the power of 3 3 multiplied to itself 3 times can be written as 3 raised to the power of 3 multiplied to 5 into 5 5 into 5 is 5 square 5 multiplied to itself 2 times so that is 5 square so 675 is 3 cube into 5 square so 675 is 3 cube into 5 square and with that we have solved both the questions of this question set.